Hello, what is up guys? Azu Gaming here, and today I'm bringing you my first gameplay commentary. Now, it's my first commentary, so, you know, go easy on me guys. I'm not very good at this, haven't done it a lot. But for this commentary, I will be playing Gun Game on the map Strike Zone. And you know what? I haven't played Gun Game on uh, Xbox One at all, actually. I just hopped in, I tried out a bit, and you know, this is like my second game I tried to get into gameplay for. And camping in this spawn actually worked pretty well, not gonna lie. I stay here mainly the most ga or the whole game and works out pretty good. I mean, people just walk right into me. And I don't get why, because I'm not using a silenced weapon. But it's whatever. So some topics I want to talk about today is drop zone and hunted free for all. Because I for one did like hunted free for all. I played that quite a bit. And Drop Zone, you know, it's not really my favorite game mode because a lot of people camp on that and it kind of makes me mad because it kind of takes no skill, they just camp next to the Drop Zone with an LMG suppressor and a thermal hybrid sight and, you know, it just makes me very mad because I think it's just a dumb game mode where people camp. I mean, real skill t takes like running around. Now, I'm kind of camping here, so it's kind of ironic. But, I mean, I'm not, like, camping with an LMG or anything, and, like, you know, it, kind of ironic, but, you know, it's not the same thing. Like, I'm not camping an objective where people just run out and go to get, if that makes any sense. I don't know, but I'm just strategically placing myself, is what I like to call it. Or dope double right there. And, you know, I just not a fan of it. You guys let me know what you think about it, but well I mean if you want to, do whatever you want. And after this MK kill, I after a while I think I start going um yeah, that's pretty dope. Now this is kinda of where I struggle. I'm not very good with the magnums, as you can see. I really struggle with these. I just cannot use them. Thank god I got a kill. Now right now I just go for 360s, so I'm dying quite often. Hope you guys probably not that fun to watch. But for the next like six deaths, it's just me doing 360s, dying, <laughs> failing miserably. Actually, pretty ugly. Nah, it's an awful way off. And you know, if you guys ever just wondering, does like anybody actually play the game that much? Because it doesn't seem like a super popular game mode. Gosh, can't believe that that killed it. Because, you know, it's pretty fun. It's actually a pretty good game if you haven't, if you don't play it a lot. I mean, it, there's no camping at all, basically, because it's so fast paced. The games are pretty short, too, so if you guys want to try it out, it's pretty fun. And, you know, all these. I got another topic I'm going to talk about before this game ends. And that is uh, YouTube. They have made changes recently, and they do make me very mad because. I don't know if it's my browser or YouTube, but every time I click on like, to go to my channel, and like a pop-up comes up, and then my browser opens a new tab to like two different ads at once. Every time I click like my channel, and it also does that when I click on my videos, and it makes me pretty mad because it kind of gets annoying. And I'm not sure if it's because I use Firefox or what, but I don't know. It's kind of weird. I wonder if other people are having the same problems because it constantly oh yeah, it's pretty pretty dope. Finally hit the 360. And you know, gameplay was average, you know, not the best. Kinda strategically placing myself as I like to call it. But, you know, it happened, it worked. I think I ended up going like 18 and 8, something like that. Which is pretty good for just doing 360s. I mean, probably could have gone 18 and 2 if I just would have stayed where I was, but. Tell me if I had, did good commentating, and you know, let me know how I did. I'm Isaac Gaming, and I'm out.